viewers, I'm now at a new hotel, my Bally's. I left the Westgate, and this is going to be a completely different tour of the other side of the strip. So we're going to head south. So I think we might start at MGM and work our way back here. Go get some food, get some drinks, show you all the fun stuff you can do in Vegas on a budget. Let's get out there. All right, back at the monorail, as you saw in the last video. So we're just going to go one stop to the MGM, heading south. Boom, and then we can go to all these different places right there. After losing a quick $20 here in the MGM, I'm about to head over there to New York, New York. One of the coolest looking ones on the strip, I'd say. And they got that roller coaster. Got the Statue of Liberty. Caliber over there. That was like the first hotel I ever stayed at in Las Vegas. So it's not that great. I don't recommend that one. Tropicana either. But this one's actually all right. A few things to do. Good dining options. But yeah, let's go up to New York. is one of my favorite like design here but we're gonna go check out the t-mobile arena got a little artworks out here and stuff you know i don't see enough food trucks it's kind of like a food truck food building i guess let's go take a look around they also have the park mgm over here they have this area called italy with like a nice food core of Italian food and stuff. I might go in there in a little in a minute to show you some of these buildings. Actually, T-Mobile is over there. Let's head that way. Still on the hunt for some food too. They had a few good choices inside, but I want to sit down at like an actual restaurant, have a beer and stuff. Those were kind of like little food stalls, kind of. But they got a beer house here. I've been here before. This was fun. They used to have like cornhole and stuff out here, but I guess they're closed now. I don't know. Uh, Jenga and stuff you could play. They still got cornhole. Let's see. Let's see if I'll nail this on the first shot. There's a lot of wind and the board's crooked. Can you do it? Oh, that's all wind. That's the wind. So they do have like different Jenga and stuff out here. Dang, that wind is really blowing. Last try. Ah, uh, whatever. Let's keep going. Going down to the T-Mobile Arena. That's where they had the Vegas Nights play. Different events, music festivals and everything. Where's all the cold beer and stuff? Nothing's here. All right, let's go see the home of the Vegas Golden Knights. Dang, everything in this area is closed. They had a nice little patio area up there. But I don't know if any everything's closed because weekday or oh forget what I was talking about this is the Salt Bay guy <laughs> it's like 52 degrees but super windy but here we go got some art all right let's see if we can cross this road without getting hit Go. It's kind of weird being a vlogger, like I said in the last video, just walking around with the camera on you, like, oh, look at me. But no, this is to help you guys and to entertain you and inform you. They do a lot of things over here at the T-Mobile Arena. They got boxing matches. They got the UFC fights. I've never actually came to one. Huh? Got a little outdoor bar too. Must be setting up for an event or something. Huh? Got concerts out here. It's a pretty nice area. But here it is. I gotta go see a hockey game sometime. Actually, a UFC fight would be cool too. For my second favorite hockey team now. Now that Seattle's got a team, I gotta go for them because I'm from Alaska right next door. Gotta go catch a game there too at Climate Pledge Arena. Is that better than T-Mobile Arena? I don't know. <laughs> All right, let's go back to the strip. All right, I said this place was closed, but I guess they open at four. And it's two for Tuesdays. Two beers for two dollars, you know we're coming back here. So, see you at four. 
nighttime this area looks so much better let me show you but it's a daytime look all right i'm still trying to make my way down towards the luxor but i got distracted and almost went to the mgm There's so much stuff going on it's a lot of distraction good time out here viva las vegas i might be going to marshall's later gotta get a new outfit put a hat on this bald head <laughs> but yeah we'll be over there later so we're leaving the park that's fun i just see a shake shack though i might have to go get some of this instead shake shack sounded all right but no nah, i don't want no burger or fast food right now but here we are we're coming up to the brooklyn bridge we can travel all of the u.s and the world in one day Hey, this would be nice to hang out, have a beer, and watch the game. Right here next to New York, New York, where we started. Nothing like the real Brooklyn Bridge, though. You can see that one here. But let's keep going on this journey. Not sure what this is, but it's party. Alright, we're gonna go through the Excalibur and then keep going. Actually, it's not that epic. It's just the Excalibur. You know what? Forget it. I already know that one's shitty, so I'm skipping it. I say it there before. It's not that great. So, we're about to go take the tram to Mandalay Bay. Oh shit, is it closed? I don't know what's going on. Shit. Tram's closed. I gotta keep walking. I haven't ate anything today. Alright, I'm gonna go find something. Alright, I don't know. Tram's out, so maybe I will go to Excalibur. To the Excalibur. After a long journey on that boulevard looking for food, finally found the spot at Buca di Beppo. They have a happy hour over here. Five dollar Peronis. And I'm getting a chicken parmesan. They have a few deals over here. I'm over in Mandalay Bay. I forgot they had the light night club. We used to go here back in the day, check out these clips. And they brought a bunch of artists out here. We saw them. It was pretty dope. But I'm trying to get back towards my hotel, so let's roll. Mandalay Bay. I've been trying to get over to the Shark Reef Aquarium. I actually might not be able to see much, but let's see. All right, you guys missed a lot since the last time I saw you. I went through all these casinos and a lot of walking. So I came down here to see the Shark Reef. I thought I might be able to take a peek from somewhere, but I guess you gotta pay to even get a little peek. So didn't get to show you. Let me give you some images from Google. <laughs> so I'm all the way at the end of the strip. Gotta go all the way back up. All right, let's head out. Over here, they got a wine collection, 10,000 bottles. Look at this tower, all bottles. Ooh. Nice. Huh, should I walk over there to Allegiant Stadium? I just saw this. I wasn't, I didn't mean to come this way. I keep getting distracted, but nothing's really planned. Just go with the flow, that's how Vegas is. You just walk around, hopefully you don't get robbed because no one's out here. This is crazy. Look at this. But yeah, I'm gonna go check out Allegiant Stadium real quick. Actually, forget all that. You guys ain't gonna get to see the stadium this time. I'll go do that another time. Oh shit, man, there's trash everywhere blowing at me. It's getting windy, storm's coming, as you can see. So. Let's go back to the main mission. Stop trying to do some side quests. Let's roll. All right, just up here is the little tram. You can go to Excalibur or Mandalay Bay. We're gonna go to Excalibur, just keep hopping. That's pretty cool. 
All right, tram's right up ahead, right there. Esports Arena. Here's the tram. Tram is accelerating. Please hold on to a handrail. I remember one reason I didn't like Excalibur. It's super smoky. I couldn't breathe. I was getting a headache. My eyes are burning. So some of these casinos are smoking allowed. Some are smoke free. Like Westgate was smoke free. That was nice. Just taping around all that cigarette smoke. All right, let's head back across and over to get some clothes. Back to where we came from. We got a long ass journey. They got the little Las Vegas Walk of Fame. All right, damn it, I'm running out of memory card. We gotta go. All right, it's time to go to Marshall's. Get a few things. Might be going out tonight, so gotta get some nice clothes. Let's go get fresh. too many good choices this time but I got two things I'm gonna try they ain't that great but let's see hard rock cafe brought my Marshall stuff into Ross into the competition to see what these jeans are like Chick-fil-A right up here. I have to stop. Playing Hollywood. We're gonna go in here tomorrow. Not showing you everything today. And Chick-fil-A tomorrow too. The Bellagio where they do the fountain show over there. Forgot how often it is. But also the Paris right here where I stayed before. This one's actually pretty nice. But Bally's might even be nicer. I like it so far already. But we out here on a Tuesday night now, getting live in Vegas. They got this place, Beer Park, here that I wanted to check out before, but it was always like too busy. Could never get in. Didn't want to wait, but a little beer garden up there. Okay, sorry. Gonna check it out later. Maybe when Justin shows up. But right now, I got my own drinks. <laughs> I remember when I stayed out here. I just come out here and smoke and just enjoy the sights. But we're heading to the hotel right next door, going over to Bally's. Take a break and start filming again tomorrow probably. But I am going to definitely show you guys the water show. One of the best free things you can do in Vegas. Two Bally's. I forget they also have this bus here. I haven't tried it, but takes you all over the strip up and down and I think it's pretty good price so we might have to do that tomorrow too they got like a lot of little food places over here stores I kind of like it Ooh, I gotta get me a donut kebab over there I got all kind of things I kind of like this area it's different just small little containers. But we've got to go back to the hotel up here in Bally's. Bally's. I'm trying to get to my casino, my hotel. Can't. Got it all blocked off. As usual, can't get to where I'm trying to go. But usually it's because of my own fault, not because stuff like that. So, I don't know. I'm going to go find another way. Back down the escalator. I took the long way because that was close. So, I could have came down the stairs and just gone right over here. Instead of going all the way around that way. 
finally, after a long day, made it back. I'm gonna go get some rest, take it easy, and see you guys tomorrow. I'll add it to this one or make a whole new one. So follow along. Next time I go over to the Miracle Mile shops and show you the best deals. So hit subscribe and follow along.